in the last You're selling stuff now? But of course. Once sin is gone. Man, your dedication is If there's anything I can help. Ace uh, we topped. Janoku. Wiraja fam may not win Dukia. Eiko, who do we goof for an elk? Dat reg drat show fund lusa, drid falum timgu, edix wo wicked hot. Ace ribidu. Rana in the cart, du lukne dimida winchelag. Ross? 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 <laughs> you 
told me to wake you up when all the grinding's done. Oh, oh so I'm, uh, right, okay, yeah, good, good. So I guess that took five hours. Um, it's the 19th of July. How long was I sleeping for? Um, mm. well, I don't know how long it had been when we ended the last part, but it's now been over 103 hours. Yikes. Um, you were asleep for... A month. About a month. You missed my 23rd birthday. Oh. On the 9th of July. Oh. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll make you up. I'll make up, I'll make up for that. Right. <laughs> um, so... Um, let me, um... Uh, briefly go over what's happened. So, um, let's start with the sphere grid. Um, the sphere grid is going to look very different now. Yikes. How long that take? That's Tidus. And it's the same for Waka. It's the same for Auron. It's the same for Riku. It's the same for Yuna. But it's... Not the same for Kamari or Lulu. Okay. They, um, theirs looks kind of empty, but, um... Or do we use them? So, uh, Tidus, Walker, Aura, and Riku, and Yuna are our main five, and they've even got 99 levels and everything. Why do you give them 99 levels, even though you've already leveled, even though you already leveled them up? Um, I will get to that. Um... Overdrive... Uh, we've got all of Tidus's. All of Walkers. We're still missing Aura's final one. We've got all of Riku's. <laughs> We've got all of Yuna's. We also have all of Lulu's, because I decided to use some black magic spheres to teach her the black magic, just so we have all our own drives. <laughs> and we've got all of Kamari. So we've got all the overdrives. Yay, ish. Um, equip, we've got... Um, everyone's got the super weapon. And, we, and then our main five have all got Ribbon, which completely protects them from status harm, virtually. Auto Haste, where they've got an automatic permanent haste. Auto Protect, where they've got an automatic permanent protect. And Defense plus 20%. They've all got that, everyone. So very simple and clean. Um, status. Everyone's HP is 9,999. Everyone's MP is 999. And all the other stats are all 255, which is the maximum it goes up to. But isn't there a way to, uh, you know, uh, go above 9,999 HP? Yes, but I don't bother with it. Um, Aeon's formation. Just made it there. Um, so, um, just to, um, now... If I just, um, one thing is that we eventually had the ability to buy clear spheres where you can turn a node on the sphere grid into an empty node, and that was particularly useful with, like, the plus ones, get rid of them, replace them with something better. Okay. And, um, obviously I caught all of the themes. Um, I beat all of these, although not on camera. I beat all of these, though not on camera. Oh yeah, also, the Greater Sphere drops Luck Spheres, the Earth Eater drops Fortune Spheres. Boy, did I have to beat those two <laughs> a lot of times, particularly oh, the Earth Eater. Oh, how many? I don't want to think about it. <laughs> and I beat all of these, and um, these are the ones that drop the spheres. Like that one there drops Agility Spheres. That one, I think, Evasion. That one, I think, Accuracy. That one, I think, Magic Defense. That one, MP, I think. That one, Magic. Um, defense. Strength. HP, etc. And what we're going to do now is take on the big boy, Nemesis. Nemesis. Um, and just before that, the formation, Tidus, Waka, Auron, those are, um, are the three that are going to be using for this fight. And... Oh, wait, 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 I almost forgot something. Because we're now going against the big boys that can do damage, we're going to change our overdrives to, um... Comrade. Comrade. Yeah, Riku now has Slayer. Yuna now has Slayer. Oh, wait, that's not Comrade. 
<laughs> right, um, this is going to be tedious, this is going to be slow, but as long as you're patient, this is a fight that you will win. Nemesis. That looks nothing like the one from Resident Evil. Okay, um... Well, do I spend tactics? Now, um, I did say Tidus, Walker, and Auron, but actually I lied. It's going to be Tidus, Walker, and Riku. And very very important, we go to Mix. We take... A Luna Blind. Luna Curtains. And a Window to Yesterday. What? And we get... Hyper Mighty G. Which, um, as well as what we've already got, we've now got Shao, Auto Life, and Regen. And we're also going to do Whoa. Focus twice. And we're going to use... Three stars. Now, to explain what's happening, Nemesis has a physical attack, which won't be much of a problem. He has, like, a magical attack that, like, attacks one person. And had it not been for the Shao, which came from Riku's Overdrive, and Focus times two, wouldn't be survivable, but now it is. Mm -hmm. And he also has another attack, which is a magical attack, which attacks all three characters. And no matter what I do, I won't be able to survive it. And that's where auto life comes into the equation. Oh, he also has a really, really special attack, which always does 99,999. So he won't survive that either. And again, that's why auto life comes into the equation. Okay, this sounds... And we've, um, and I did three stars so that MP doesn't cost because of run out of MP when doing quick hit, because it usually takes 36 MP, but now we're just going to attack it. Oh. And I'm not going to use overdrives, because I have a feeling he has a really nasty counter-attack when an overdrive is used against him. Uh. Well, I mean, I'll be using Riku's overdrives, but they're going to be defensive overdrives. Fair enough. When an offensive overdrive is used against him, I think he has like a really nasty counter-attack. So, I'm only uh, going to be able to use quick hits. Do you know how much... Oh, yeah, this is that attack, which goes to one person. And had it not been for the Shao and the Focus, Walker would not have survived that. So, uh, do you know how much HP this, this Nemesis got? No, but it's millions. That sounds like... That sounds, that, mm, that sounds exactly like... That sounds like the most HP we see in the boss. Sorry? The most... It's the most. It's the boss that has the most HP, right? If only. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Why is that? Ah, uh, you'll see shortly. I don't know how long this takes. Oh yeah, this will take a while because he will defeat us quite a lot of times, and I am gonna have to repeatedly do Hyper Mighty G, Focus, and Three Stars, and that's kind of why I put the Overdrive on Comrade because. That way, if we do get wiped out, re oh, this, this is it. This um, this is going to kill everyone. But thankfully, we've got also life, and, and that's why I made sure we're on comrade. Wait, I think you should have got an overdrive. Uh, Panikin? Uh, is there anything that gives them gives them an overdrive? Everyone's on Comrade, Riku should have got an overdrive from that. Uh, I hope you were lucky. That is weird. Uh, that is, is that worrying? Oh. The reason why I put everyone on Comrade is because if that attack gets used, then, although we get wiped out, We'd be recovered with auto life, and then Vika would have another overdrive, and we'd just do Hyper Mighty G again. Her overdrive gorge should have failed. He just, he just. I practiced this fight, <laughs> and that's. 
Let, okay, let's just calm down and we'll, 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 we'll look at it afterwards, okay? I did put Riku on Comrade, didn't I? I hope. I put everyone on Comrade, didn't I? Well, that's, that's a lie. You did not put everyone on Comrade. Well, out of the main five. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Uh, mm, uh, okay, what's this? <laughs> See, her drive gorge filled from that. Right, um... Oh yeah, that's, uh, that's another reason why healing waters are important, because I used one to recover HP. They fully restore the party's HP, and that's why I was always moaning at you to get healing waters. They're very useful. Oh. Now... Because that's what I'm going to recover with when we... basically get wiped out and then come back to life with auto life. Okay, so well, I've it, it, done that. Now I need to now, do focus twice again. What is it, does he do anything if you summon an Aeon? Sorry? It, does he do anything if you, if you summon an Aeon? Uh, when you get to this stage, I think the characters are better than Aeons. Okay. And every time we come back to life, unfortunately, we are going to have to do Hyper Mighty G, Focus Focus, and Free Stars, because when you get wiped out, you lose that sort of stuff. Now we can start attacking again. Now we should, then we should probably get to someone again. And rather than heal with white magic, I say if he's going to damage us, then we should steal the HP back from him. That's what I say. Is that it? No. Ultra Spark is the one to be wary of. I was only paying attention when hit with a freaking heat wave over here. Yes, it is rather hot at the moment. Yes. Doesn't help, doesn't help that we're in the room, square, and the door's closed. So that means it's going to get very hot in here. We like to have privacy when we do our recording, or at least I do. I've got to make sure we have the window closed, because if we have that open, I'm guaranteeing you that's going to be loud. That's going to be loud. The yeah, Ultra Spark is the only attack that worries me. Well, we could get an arrow overdrive that point. Nice. Apart from that other one, which I mentioned, and that much. I can live with. Now, the fun fact: if you have, if you, if this, if if, if if you're, if you're got this game in America, this is technically the the final, the, the ultimate boss in that version of the game. Um, without giving a spoiler, you know, name starts with P. That wasn't in the American version. I know, but you know, name starts with P. Yes. Well, some people actually consider this, consider Nemesis, to be harder than that one. Really? Yeah. I thought I had, I had the other way around. I, well, personally, I think this, I think Nemesis is easier, but some people consider Nemesis to be harder. But hey, in the American version, this guy's the hardest no matter what. Yeah, because, uh... Do they not even have the Dark Ape? No, they don't. Huh. They only, they, they only got... Damn it, Nemesis. Stars! Riku, recover! Go! Oh. There you go. Yeah, it worked that time. I said, I said for maybe in some parts that the uh, the American the, like the American version did, they didn't get this content until the HD the HD uh, the HD remaster. Do they have like the Dark Age and stuff? Now, yeah. Uh, well, that's nice. But apart from that one glitch sort of thing where Riku didn't get her overdrive, um, as long as she, as long as we have the patience to keep doing this, it shouldn't go wrong. Because now, Hyper Mighty G is what's keeping us alive. Now, I find it kind of weird how it's always when we get a game, there's like this, they get, when they get a game first, when we get it, we get extra content, so it makes it even harder. I don't know why. Well, it's not the case with every game, but... Think it up. Uh, well, um, it's from World 2003. But it's not the case with every game in the world, is it? No, it's not. It's mostly Square Enix games. Yeah. <laughs> that cannon attack, um, I did practice, and without doing focus, it does over 10,000, which is too much to survive. And with doing two focuses, it does about 9,000, which is fine. Um, 
Possibly I could get away with it with one focus, but it's better to be safe than sorry. I mean, all it's costing you is one turn. Oh well. If he didn't have that overdrive counter, which I think he does, he wouldn't be such a big boy. <laughs> let me guess, he would do, uh, let me guess, uh, what's the new, uh, what, one? Slot reels? Attack reels. Attack reels, yeah. Yeah, we'd be seeing lots and lots of attack reels. Um, oh wait, I meant to use Drain as Tidus, aren't I? I don't worry, you got another shot as him. Oh yeah, and that, um, you know what I was saying about the Jumbo Flan being tough? Yeah. Uh, well, from doing a bit of research, I found out that Anima's Pain attack is classed as a magic attack. Yeah. And so I was actually able to beat him quite easily from using Anima's Pain, because that did 99,999 every time. And so the Jumbo Flan wasn't so bad after all. And I was able to maximize my magic, because I was able to kill him easily and get some nice magic spheres. Happy me, happy me, happy me. Um, this part is now about 20 minutes long, but do you want to just do the whole Nemesis yes. thing in one video? Yes, it'll be, it'll be, it'll be, it'll be easier. easier that Even way. if it goes on for like 45 minutes. Yes. Okay. I'm expecting that with, that with that certain boss. So you want to just do the whole Nemesis thing, and this part goes on until Nemesis dies. Yes. Okay. Now Riku's got an overdrive, but we've got no, there's no advantage to be gained from using it, so I'm not going to use it. We've already got... Everybody's already got Hyper Mighty G still. I just wonder how the Americans beat this, how the Americans beat this guy, because they, they didn't even have the expert Sphere Grid either. Until, until the HD Master. How you beat... Oh, this oh. is the one that always kills. Armageddon! This is like an upgrade of Omega's Nova. Yeah, you are not going to survive this. No unless, matter what. Or, unless, unless you, unless you got all your life. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, trying to survive that's like trying to survive Zan Mato. It's just not going to happen. Let me, oh, let me guess. Can Zan Mato kill this, kill this guy? Yeah. There's nothing that Zan Mato doesn't kill. Even that super super, even that other. Absolutely one. everything. There is nothing that survives Zan Mato. Nothing. Okay, so that's probably. Okay. It's a good thing we've got plenty of Lunar Blinds. Why are you calling it Lunar Blinds? And yesterday, I mean, window to yesterday. The door to tomorrow. Welcome to the world of tomorrow! An unhyper mighty, oh damn it, thing. Okay, we're dying again. Riku, don't you dare do that glitch thing again. Okay, 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 that is a good question. What happened the first time? I don't know. You don't know. At some point, I may um, do a bit of healing water farming. Because we've got less than 30. Less than what? Healing waters, we've got less than 30. All right. So I might do some farming at some point. Because obviously, we're not going to do everything today, are we? Maybe. <laughs> How about you don't do Ultra Spark, Mr. Nemesis? Thank you. But <laughs> Are you sure you see them more? What are you doing? Oh, free star. Look at those. Um I can't even remember. <laughs> it is Gantia, I'm guessing. This is the second focus, isn't it? Yep. Is he dead yet? Yeah, everyone now does 99,999, and that's why I said that 9,999 is puny, because this is the real damage. And yeah, even Yuna and Riku are doing this much damage. We've turned the women into hard nuts. 
Which must have, uh, well, except for one of them. Yeah, apart from one of them. Eternal Cannon. I'll live with that. Oh yeah, another thing that's interesting is that a few nights ago, I had a dream that I wish I did not have. A dream that could be relieved that you did not have. What? It was a dream about Final Fantasy X. A dream about Kamari. <laughs> What? Do you want to know more details? Please tell me this is what my big involves. I had a dream that the Guardians were being judged, but they weren't judged on their ability to fight. They were judged on their ability to sing and dance. <laughs> and I had a dream that Kamari was dancing with his spear while singing and roaring, I'm sexy and I know it. <laughs> What? <laughs> what? What? So it's like, what? So it's like, oh, you're sexy and I know it. <laughs> oh, <you're showing. laughs> he was literally dancing with his spin while singing and roaring, I'm sexy and I know it. I wonder, I wonder, was, what, I wonder what it was like when you said, I'll oh, shake my little tush. And it wasn't just singing, but it was like roaring as well. <laughs> Like I said, I've already said it when he said I'll shake my little tush. <laughs> and it's like, why did I have to dream that? <laughs> you can't question dreams. Is that the end? No. So, I'll just block. Damn it. Is it going to glitch out again? Whoops, it did. How's it doing that? I don't know. Is this issue? Is this issue going to be? Is this issue? Is this issue? So this is issue going to be part. This never happened during the practice. Mm -hmm. Look at what's happening. It never happened during the practice. It's weird. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how it works. I don't have a fault. I don't know how with the other, uh, the other bosses because they sound tedious. Our most important thing is being able to do Hyper Mighty G because that's what's because that way we won't die no matter what. Star. I mean, I know I could just manually do auto life and shackle, but that would go on forever. So I just do it this way. Do you see our attacks are more powerful than Ultima? Unless that goes up as well. What's, what's that? Is, 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 our, is our regular attacks more powerful than Ultima? Um, I'd imagine so, yeah. At least I can get some attacks underway. Before he, before he eventually does ultra, before he eventually does ultra swap again. What's that? Before he eventually does ultra swap again. <laughs> <laughs> and probably, oh yes, he's gonna do eternal cannon. I'll settle it if he does. Hey, I don't know. Right, he I'll... needs to go for blocker so times and can get their overdrive back or at least come close to it. Wow, he's almost there. Ooh, oh, counter attack. I forgot. Wait, yeah, wait, yeah, counter attack. Tigers, Whopper, and Auro will have counter attack. All oh, right. Well, at least we've got a couple of attacks. We, at least we've got a couple of attacks in where we can uh, hopefully get a lot of damage done and then be killing. How are we gonna know when he's dead? It will say overkill, and then he'll die. I thought that'd be a fan. I thought that'd be a fancy camera angle. That's why. That's why I know. Uh. Uh. Please do your normal attack. Um. Uh. uh 
Not that. Is it a pill? And it is. Do they all die at the same time? Uh, roughly, I think. Like core teamwork, we all work together. There's nothing going to stop us because we are invincible. What's what's that? What's that? Liquid liquid nitrogen. <laughs> I'll just fly, or not. Is he gonna die already? Is that, is it, can you can he be at least a, is can he be affected by zombie? Uh, he's probably immune to most things, to be honest. I mean, he is a super boss at the end of the day. Uh. Spark. Oh wow. To me, tight, forget his overdrive. Just quickly, what does comrade what does comrade do? Your overdrive forge fills when when your ally takes damage. Wow, this is gonna take a lot this is gonna take a long time. We got all the we got all the techniques though. Quick hits useful. I wonder why is that? Why is that? It uses like less of a turn. Sometimes you can get like extra turns if you do it. Yay! You know what's next, don't you? The final boss. Dark Valfor. Followed by... <laughs> followed by Aurum's final overdrive. <laughs> we get no many peas. Oh, wait. oh yeah, max level. I imagine killing that thing would have granted you a lot of AP. You've beaten my mightiest beast. Yeah, yeah, carry on. Blah 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 Anything, any of these one that's useful? The item doesn't serve a useful purpose. It's one of those things where having it is the reward. It's like a mark of great achievement. Yeah, given to those who have surpassed mortal bounds. Lovely, lovely. And I wonder what the last one is. Um, and how are the overdrives then? So that's good, that's good, that's not that's good. Not good. <laughs> no, we, should, we, should be able to get, we should be able to get them. Uh, I'm just going to very, very quickly... Very, very quickly... Very, very quickly... What are you doing? You'll see. Oh no! <laughs> this thing's a lot more dangerous than that ever was, right? Make his overdrive gorgeous back. Good. <laughs> Right then, should we call it quits there? Yes, Trent, we just beat a nemesis. Right, see viewers in the next part for Dark Valve, but we'll continue here and then we'll get the airship, then get the airship in Besaid, and then we'll do Dark Valve. Well, can't we just say we'll meet them, we'll meet them in Besaid? No. Oh. So that's yes. the end of this part, even though it's probably like. About 35 minutes long, but hey. What do you do? Right then, see you later. <laughs>